We're mixing it up today, so. And here it comes! Oh, oh no, Sterling! Ooh, right off the face. And North Carolina is wasting no mother of pearl! Oh, oh, did he... Welcome to the heavyweight bout between Sterling's face! He got knocked Curving down. the ball path, or bending it like Beckham, is an art that only a handful of players have mastered. Oh my, dominance. Where I grew up, there was a rock that people would launch themselves off of into the water, uh, cliff diving. And I've seen some nasty accidents from those who weren't able to gauge how close uh, the rocks were on their jump. That was terrifying. <laughs> that just took me back. This from Sweden establishes a new world record for pole. I'm liking the gamification of this video. You don't even necessarily need a plane to skydive anymore. What? There's actually a rather cheap alternative. <laughs> Everyone thought there was a goal on the play, but the goalie had actually made an amazing save, which allowed for his team to return the favor and put a point on the board for themselves. If number six wants to win the game, he better get up and play and quit faking an injury. What is death diving, you ask? Death diving is a form of extreme freestyle diving from great heights, jumping with outstretched arms and belly first. Pretty so competitive belly flops. Watch as Lucian Both establishes a new world record. But he's gonna win it by two meters. Lucian Both. Is he faster than Usain Bolt? That's more like they look kind of similar. Tessa Virtue and Scott Miroir won the gold medal with this uncommon performance. The crowd really liked their originality. I like it too. Go on. Feast your eyes on the highest Olympic high jump ever. He sauntered into that like a gazelle. <laughs> These ping pong players got bored with the regular old game, so they decided to spice things up. He takes his time, and it didn't pay off. This brave soul doesn't even need a Better parachute than I do. to skydive. I'm not gonna need it. Are you sure? First Blaine Sumner has the world record for three lift. lifts. Bench press, squat, and deadlift. All the weight combined totals an amazing 1,275 kilograms. Cheerleaders are very flexible, so that means naturally they can fit into cars more easily. This no. is perfect for carpooling experimentation and for making history as it happens. As they it's like a clown a car. For the highest number of adults in a car. <laughs> okay. That's insanity. Oh, how did he hang on to that? That was that the double front 720 or the double front? Oh my god! This guy's. I have to brace myself for these. Simply incredible. Where do you think he is? I didn't know competitive frisbee was a thing. Wow. Frisbee golf? Some yes. people argue that athletes are overpaid, 
but sometimes they forget that these amazing individuals always give it 100%. It helps to make that pass. Hustle by Tate, look at this. Watch as these strong men best six regular men in the rope pull event. Whoa. I need to catch more table tennis. The fastest tennis players. Here's an example of his great speed. Whoa. Whoa. This power lifter accomplished his goal of lifting 315 pounds with just one arm. What's this kid up to? Oh, that's some wholesome father-son content. <laughs> crashing over the scores okay. table. Curry for three. It's good. You know, under normal circumstances, with this... but was it necessary? These football skills are designed to entertain, bedazzle, and amuse. Nelly Giganisha made a beautiful performance in this figure skating routine. Outfield for the break. Bennett to Frood. I need to look into that. Tell me if you know anything about competitive frisbee. Lucky mistake. It's nice to see football Here's highlights like that instead of the dives. Motocross jumps ever. Feast your eyes on what very well could be the fastest team in the world. The Formula One mechanics are insane. What's that? Bouncer by the mound up the middle. Stare by him. The spin, the throw. Get toward the way. We present to you the world record for the highest wave ever served. Where do you think that is? Like pipeline or Portugal? Maybe. Bobby Ryan, he tries to split the defense and does the drag it around like one who lost the stick. Now he's in a rebound score! Spectacular goal! This guy again. Gaia. So this was a subscriber request. The channel was Dose of Internet. I don't know if that has any affiliation with Daily Dose of Internet, which is another channel I've been recommended a lot, but I haven't seen anything from them yet. A lot of these were sports that I only watch once every four years when the Olympics come around. Namely the field events. Track I end up watching with my gran, but pole vaulting, what were some of the other field events they showed? High jump, maybe that's called long jump. I don't catch it very often. It was cool to see some hockey highlights as well. I watched that with my family, but martial arts is still going to be number one in my interest and no martial arts clips in this one. If you think that there's a sport that I haven't watched on the channel that I should, please tell me what it is. I'm open to anything really. I like to watch top athletes in any sport. And I don't have a book recommendation for you today, so we're going to skip that and go straight to the music. So for the music, it'll be go to workout songs. And that's mostly because I'm going to ask you to drop some recommendations for me of songs I can listen to while I'm working out. But what do I typically listen to? A lot of Cypress Hill while I'm exercising. Uh, Dr. Green Thumb for some reason. That has nothing to do with pumping you up or feeling hyped. Uh, the Distance by Cake is always on an exercise playlist of mine. They actually have a very nice 
cover of Gloria Gaynor's I Will Survive. While I'm cycling, I listen to this one called Sub-Zero by a DJ Ben Clock. I think of all the electronic music I've recommended on this channel, this one is the most techno. It's very minimal. If I think of other workout songs, I'll let you know down in the comments, but that's all from me for today. This was just a short one, so thank you for watching with me, and I'll catch you in the next.